the real reason why Roblox is canceling these games. Hey, yo, welcome back to the channel on Roblox Sweets. Now, before the video start, make sure you hit that subscribe button. I know I always say that, but please do it. These videos take a lot of time to make, and that will be very appreciated if you do. Now, let's just get straight into the video. If you're a game maker, let me tell you, you're lucky because Roblox haven't either found your game or they haven't found your game. And what I mean by that is you must not be one of them big games. Yes, I know what you're thinking. And if you're probably watching this video, you're probably wondering why that your game has been removed. Well, with games that haven't reached over a hot well a thousand players or a hundred thousand visits roblox is basically taking down your game now as illegal as that might sound you're on roblox website and let me tell you on roblox website whatever they say goes that doesn't mean you can't create the game over that doesn't mean you have to like start from scratch that doesn't mean your game is permanently gone what they do is they remove the game from the official website probably because it haven't received an update in about like a year or so most games that roblox has been removing is games that hasn't been worked on in decades and yes decades so if you're still making bank off of a roblox game and probably like have an old game that you like made back in like 2018 2019 then let me tell you roblox is gonna remove that pretty soon if they don't find it or if it never had over a thousand players basically roblox is saying these games are taking up a lot of space on an official roblox website you have to consider how many people play roblox a day and it's more than the average number of players that actually play roblox it can go all the way up to 1 million players at a time but the minute it reaches over 1 million players roblox will start to break just how you seen adopt me had 500,000 players in one game adopt me basically broke records everywhere for the top roblox game and it just continued to grow grow and grow and yes adopt me is still popular to this day Roblox basically said they were going to rem remove Adopt Me, and Adopt Me didn't know what was going on either. So, once when they both talked to Adopt Me or the creators of Adopt Me, I want to say they worked something out, but I don't really know because I'm not into the full story. Or, more of, I don't know the full story of what happened with Adopt Me. All I know is basically Adopt Me broke records, had 500,000 players on at once, and basically broke Roblox. And ever since then, small games or small game communities have basically been getting their game removed. Now it's fine if you're still working on your game but you made it like 4 or 5 years ago, that's perfectly fine, your game is gonna stay. This is for people that don't work on their game anymore and hasn't reached over like 100 players in general. Your games are getting removed and the reason for that being is just because Roblox wants to clear up some space on the actual website of people people that don't play games anymore or don't really care about games that used to happen or play in the past. I know a lot of games were ruined and that's the games that Roblox really wants to go for is the games that were ruined and that people don't really like. But with everyone coming back and forth on Roblox saying, oh why did you remove my game, it was such a good game, it still received high numbers, oh please revive my game, it really gives you're basically saying that Roblox isn't doing their job correct when they're trying to make it a better environment for us quote unquote players in general as a better environment for us to play the game instead of having lag, feedback, particle effects that happen, random effects that happen, bungee effects that happen stuff in that nature that just goes on with roblox when they remove these games they're basically fixing that and i find that really honorable of roblox how they want to actually help our games instead of destroying them but what can i say some people still take it as roblox is coming after them or coming after your game even though they haven't even updated their game in like three four years but i guess that'll bring me to the end of this video like comment subscribe if you haven't already and i'll see you guys in the next video peace